Hello, beta testers. At Gamescom, this trailer was dropped, and here are the dislikes they try to hide from you. On Xbox, the comments read as follows. If only this was a parody, it would have sold at least 30 copies. There are games that push gaming to new heights, like Baldur's Gate 3, and then there are games like this. I just know the Twitter feeds of the devs who made this absolutely reek. Looks like another game that will kill their studio. Hope the short-sighted ESG cash infusions are worth it. I heckin' love vitiligo, ligo, fucking love vitiligo, 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 the shit is good for your hair. I love playing as the bad guys. My favorite part was when Shaniqua Zizer said, Words have power. Stunning, brave, uh, quality success? Mm. I love Larry Fink and ESG scores. I'm just here to say I wish everybody who worked on this game good luck on a job market. For those of us who can't see the dislikes at any time, they're up to 2.1K. 4K now. High definition, crystal clarity, as this game slips into obscurity. Dead on arrival, the game. Well, that just happened, the game. Shit, so lame. Who's to blame? Tell me, beta tester, in the comment section which console has the best responses because PlayStations read as follows. This is why we can't see the dislikes. If you asked AI to make a game, I bet this game has depth, is subtle, and not pretentious whatsoever. Yeah, this game's as subtle as a sledgehammer to the face when it comes to the message. Dustborn? Is this based on the game's shelf life? This game definitely part of the Soulsborne genre in the sense that it'll be impossible to get through. Xbox and PlayStation have 12k views at roughly the same amount of likes and dislikes. We may not play the same systems, but our tastes in games definitely align when it comes to this trash. Get this woke shit out my fucking face. Female in gaming, half shaved head, every single time. Y'all saw Saints Row said let's do worse, it's woke, the video game. Do games like these get funding from external sources, nonprofits, or political special interest groups? It's hard to believe that the marketing data supports robust sales for games that look like it's right in line with the latest Saints Row. Funny you mentioned Saints Row. This looks like it was made for people who enjoyed Forspoken and Saints Row. Spent so much time on making pretentious characters that they couldn't be bothered to actually lip sync any of the motherfuckers in the game. But that's okay, because there's a black woman and when she opens her mouth, you must be silent. Maybe we're hazy on the woman part because there could be a dick down there but they can identify as whatever they want to and be as ugly as they want to because even though we can make them look like whatever we want we've chosen to make them ugly because even niggas who pass in your imaginary world is offensive wow ESG through the roof Xbox said. investors burnt money on who Xbox said. I do not anticipate this game selling well Xbox gets its own forespoken 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 I, I love Larry Fink and ESG scores This game just screams in D and AI outsource the absolute state of Western game dev. Good luck recouping production costs. Does Vitiligo give you max ESG scars? Diverse and inclusive, please tick the box. She pregnant, man. Back to Roblox. In the Game Awards trailer, all the gamers came together. You'd have to pay me to rewatch this trailer. Someone on Twitter will still say it's not enough final boss is the patriarchy this game is made for kotaku i wouldn't even pirate this cringe they wouldn't play it for free are you hearing this can we please bring back the dislike counter do you see what you're provoking game of the year for journalists they're all a joke all the games journalists are jokes 
This is so woke it's like they're making fun of themselves. They, them, vegans, the game. I'm glad they say vegans because vegans have the reputation of needing to tell you that they're vegan like anybody give a fuck, like anybody ask, bitch. You know what I mean? Some people try to live their life and just get the fuck in and out. And you're here just like, oh, did you just misgender me? Did you just misgender me? I'm in the drive-thru. You're gonna refer to me. What do I look like to you? Do I not look like what I want to be? With my long hair and my ugly face and my square jaw and my jowls and my Adam's apple. Oh, I would like a Snapple. I'd like an iced tea, that's brisk, baby. I'm up all night to get, 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 I'm a pool. ESG score farming simulator, diversity the video game. Can you hear me rolling my eyes while I'm saying it? It's as disingenuous as a, a fake college brochure. This is just embarrassing. It's too cringe to even hate watch. You can't even score a black Velma kind of, oh man, we gotta check this garbage out. Not not a so bad it's good, just a so bad it's bad. You are bad, this is bad. You should feel kind of sad. What's wrong here? You dumb blank. Fill in the blank, I think you know what I might have put there. My favorite comment, best for last, is point 5% of the world's population has vitiligo, yet it's become the trendiest thing in games this year. It actually goes back a little bit further with them pushing this. And this game Dustborn we're talking about was, it's been in development for about 7 years. S speaking on how transparent the disingenuous ESG score chasing virtue signaling garbage is, at a time where people are becoming so aware and tired that they're memeing Bud Light and things like it into the grave where it belongs, watching games devote time to virtue signaling in the way of spending time to make an actress uglier and flattening women's chests to make their, their shoulders more broad and make them more man-ish in ways that cripple your production, your, your game, sometimes a franchise. And, and, and it's unmarketable. It is now repulsive instead of appealing. It's delightful to watch because these people, they, they didn't listen. They're not willing to listen. So what can we do with laugh? When you're hurting yourself, when we told you to just, just stop stepping right now, there's rakes all around you. Stop stepping, stop, don't move and you just keep moving. So instead of taking notes of other people's success, they have to tear down. They're upset that the Asians are respecting fan service and giving people what they paid for. That's disgusting and wrong and rude and it must be a part of all. You know what I mean? <laughs> I don't like it, so it's problematic, man. Asians out here respecting their properties instead of ruining them and hastily ushering them into an early grave. And uh, it's more than a lazy gender and race swap, so I guess they the enemy, you know what I'm saying? A lot of these hypocrites are understanding to fade right back into the background where they belong because girls like attractive women too. Jiggly titties, big boob waifus that in many cases, for some real gamers, inspired awakenings of their own playing through some of the characters that may have been more in line with what they wanted to biologically identify as. Like, subscribe, and comment or correct me below. But it's my belief that if Lara Croft or Mortal Kombat didn't have that appeal right off the bat, that they'd never have made it this far. If you are blessed with assets and I hope you understand that you should never be made to feel like you're you're hiding them because salty, sad, and jealous people in the industry currently, you know, as we are sweeping them out the door, have tried to diminish you. What could diminish you? You're perfect. You're amazing. To anybody listening, to those of you still disliking when you, they're trying to hide it, still commenting when they normally remove it. Your why change is happening. Thank you. Why you stay with me all day, risking your butt for someone who's never given you anything but trouble? I know what it's like to try and rebuild a life. I had a bad day too, once.